Hot and sour dumpling soup is a dish from Shanxi province. If you love spicy Xi'an style noodles and noodle soups, or even Chinese American hot and sour soup, you'll probably like this recipe too. The best part of this recipe is, the soup base is simply the water you boil the dumplings in. The key to the soup is twofold. Firstly, pouring hot oil over the chili flakes and garlic gives the soup lots of extra flavor without needing a chicken or pork stock. Secondly, there are some simple but high impact ingredients in the soup. The chili flakes and garlic, plus Chinese black vinegar, a little dark soy sauce, and sugar to balance out the heavy pour on the black vinegar. Try not to skimp on that vinegar, by the way. It'll take away all the charm of the dish. If you like, you can taste as you go so it's not overwhelming. Sesame seeds and scallions also add a great texture to the soup. In the end, all you have to do is boil the dumplings and ladle in some of that hot cooking water. Having frozen homemade or store-bought dumplings at the ready makes it even easier. This is a great way to eat dumplings as it gets colder outside, and if you want something new beyond the standard dipping sauce and chili oil. Not that there's anything wrong with that either. As for what dumpling you use, the filling can be just about anything you like. We have plenty of recipes, so we'll link them in the description. I'll admit that when my mom first came to us with this recipe, we were skeptical. You'd be surprised that a soup that's essentially largely water and black vinegar would be so delicious, but the pork from the dumplings really comes in and mellows everything out, and it's an incredibly delicious, savory lunch or easy dinner, and this is one of our new favorites. The best part is that the soup is made purely with the boiling water from the dumplings. It's kind of like our wonton soup base, which is another favorite that we make literally all the time. So don't dump out that water. It's useful. We hope you enjoyed this recipe.